guys, welcome back to my channel and my first YouTube video of 2022, which is just a real crazy because I feel like 2021 literally went like this. I'm not gonna lie, this is my second attempt of filming this video. I was halfway through filming and my camera fell off. The ring light is kind of just balanced on because it's for an iPhone, not a camera, fell off and I lost the footage. I'm kind of thankful that the camera is still working, I hope. Um, so we're gonna just start this YouTube video again and pretend that didn't happen. As you can tell by the day's title, I am doing a what I got for Christmas. I know I'm a bit late to the party. All I will say is Jack was over, who's my long distance boyfriend for those of you who don't know. Um, and let's just say I just, I didn't obviously want to film when he was here. Like I just wanted to spend as much time with him as possible. So I'm only filming this now. I'm filming this on the 3rd of January. I will get this up as soon as I possibly can for you guys. So I'm gonna go through like the main gifts that I got for Christmas. I personally love watching these videos. Um, please don't think that I'm doing this video to brag or anything like that. I just wanna showcase you guys what I got for Christmas. Like I said, I love watching other people's videos um, of what they got for Christmas. It gives me inspiration and yeah, I don't know. I just enjoy watching it. I hope you guys enjoy watching it. And if you do, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe as well. Also, I'm aware that some of my nails are broken. Um, let's not mind that. I am going to nail salon in a few days to get a fresh set. So I'm not gonna go through everything I got for Christmas, but I will just say that in my stocking this year from Santa, I did get a load of things I needed, just like, you know, like toiletries, my foundation, my concealer, um, you know, things for my hair to push it back whilst I'm doing my makeup, fluffy socks, you know, like the whole shebang. Um, so I'm just gonna go into what my parents got me for Christmas. So the main present my parents got me um, is, it's not a physical thing I can show you here, but let's just say that in January slash February, I am going through a, let's say a glow up period. I'm getting a few things done that I've wanted to get done for an extremely long time. And one of them is hair extensions. And you're probably gonna be like, you literally do not need hair extensions. I do have clip-ins now. However, my natural hair is more or less this length. Um, so I'm getting Beauty Works Nano Bead extensions, which I'm so, so excited for. I really wanted the tapes, uh, but I'm going on a few holidays hopefully this year. Fingers crossed. Um, and I know the tapes don't really work well in seawater. So I thought, let's go for the nano beads. I'm so, so excited. And obviously anyone who's had hair extensions before or knows about hair extensions they're not cheap so my parents said that they would pay for them as my main christmas present obviously i took up on the offer so that is the main thing that my parents got me they did get me a few other little things which i will show you now so the first thing they got me was these boots which i'm going to show you now i saw these boots for sale on black friday weekend and um i've never owned a pair of shoes like it and i just fell in love with them and they're also super super comfy so she just could not get them for me <laughs> so these are the shoes and if you've seen my first instagram post of the year i am wearing these shoes they are literally let's put them the right way if that is the right way never mind they are honestly adorable they have the zip they have the lace they are so fluffy inside guys and so, so comfy but like i said i've never owned a pair of shoes like it um and i've wanted some like this for the longest time so when i saw these especially because they were in the sale um we just had to grab a pair so thank you mum for buying these for me and dad uh, second thing my parents got me was again something i knew about because when we were mum were shopping on black friday i saw this as well and she saw my heart, a thing just light up, and she was like, okay, I have to get that for you as well. But it is this beautiful Carvella shoulder bag. I'm not quite sure if you can see with the light, but it has got a bunch of different color, like sparkles. It's like silver, blue, and pink, which are my, my favorite colors. Um, it's a shoulder bag. I love shoulder bags. I'm not a massive bag person, so the days I do take a bag, I do like a shoulder bag. I mean, this one's a bit more special, but to be honest, life's too short not to have sparkle in your life. So yeah. I'm absolutely obsessed with this. Then every year my mum always gets me MAC makeup. It's kind of like, I feel like it's a tradition now. She does it every year. She'll get me new makeup from MAC. First thing she got me comes in this cute little MAC bag and it is basically a lip set. So in the bag we have a gloss, a lipstick and a lip liner. And this is like in a dark reddish color. And I'm obsessed. Like light red lipstick honestly makes me look like a clown so she knew what she was doing when she called me the dark red colors but i also just love the bag it's got like these two zips two different compartments perfect little travel makeup bag the next thing she got me from mac was this eyeshadow palette guys i'm gonna let you on a secret even today 
my eyeshadow is bronzer. Like I've been using bronzer. I feel like the only bronze eyeshadow colors I have, I've got like a tint of sparkle in them, which I just don't want. So my mum got me, um, I've literally just got it on my hands already. That's great. Anyways, my mum got me this one, which I love because it does have the bronze colors. Uh, as you can see, I've just scratched it back. And, and it's also got a bit of color because I was saying I don't really have like any color eyeshadows so i absolutely love this one it's very like christmasy the red and golds as well so that is what my mum got me from mac this year the last thing i'll show you what she got me it was this super cute travel jewelry box and i feel like she read my mind with this because i don't have a travel jewelry box i literally put my jewelry in makeup bags and they get tangled and they just look shit <laughs> so this one is in my favorite pink color it's got k on it and then inside it's got all the compartments for your jewellery. So I absolutely love that, especially because I'm on holiday. Fingers crossed in a couple of weeks, so this will come very much in handy. I'm now going to go on to what Jack got me for Christmas. So going back to my January slash February glow up, Jack is paying for one of my appointments, um, which is something I've wanted to have done for a couple of years now. Um, I'm not going to talk about it too much on here. If you follow me on Instagram, you may know a bit more as I have opened up about it. All my social links will be in the description below, FYI. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to talk about it too much. Obviously, I will talk about it on here once I've had it done. It's just something I've wanted done for so, so long because that's something I'm really insecure about. So my main Christmas present from Jack is that he's paying for that appointment for me, which like I said, is not cheap. <laughs> so thank you, Jack, for that. He has got me a few little extra bits, which I'm gonna show you guys now. So going back to what I said about me getting uh, Beauty Works hair extensions next month. Now, when I originally went for the consultation for my hair extensions, I didn't know that they were Beauty Works hair extensions. So when I found out they were Beauty Works hair extensions, I was actually really happy because I'm not gonna lie, I'm quite obsessed with Molly May. And anyone who knows Molly May, is a beauty works hair um influencer ambassador so when she came out with her christmas sets with me knowing i had beauty works hair extensions being installed in january i was like okay i really want one of her sets especially because my ghd straighteners which i've had for like five years is definitely on its way out so i kind of needed these straighteners anyways and i have read that the beauty works um hot tools work really well with the hair extensions so this massive box, I don't know if you can read it, but it says Beauty Works by Molly May. And this is one of Molly May's Beauty Works Christmas sets. So when you open it, again, it has here Beauty Works by Molly May. And then inside we have a heat protection sort of cover mat wrap. How would you even call that? Bag. <laughs> we have the hair curlers, the hair straighteners. We have a paddle brush, which has fallen down here. Whoop paddle brush, another paddle brush which is really really soft for the hair extensions, we also have a heat mat and we also have a little sample of the uh what's it called the 10 in 1 miracle spray from booty Wet. so i'm so excited to try this i've not opened any of yet any of it yet as i am waiting to have my hair extensions installed first but guys this set you can probably tell from my smile like I'm literally in love. <laughs> that set also comes with the Molly May hair clips. If you guys know what I'm talking about, they're obviously at the bottom somewhere, but that set also does include them as well. So continuing on with Molly May, because I am literally obsessed with Molly May, um, Jack did buy me Molly May's tan filter by Molly May, which I'm so excited for. I've used Saint-Tropez for years and years and years and years. And then last December, um, Ubronz, who's an American tanning company, gifted me with their tan, which I also loved. Um, and now I'm really intrigued to try the filter from Molly May. So when you open it, it has filter from Molly May, it has one of the pictures. So this set includes two um, tanning lotions. Tanning lotions? tanning mousses, so I've got one wrapped up, one not wrapped up, and honestly guys, the packaging for this, I'm just, I'm I'm literally obsessed, I'm sorry if the lighting's too harsh, you can't see it, but literally obsessed, and then it also comes with a face mitt, which I just think is so, so, so cute, and the normal mitt as well. Okay, and then the last thing that Jack got me was something, again, I've been wanting for years and years and years, but it is a Polaroid camera so he got me this and he got me some extra film for it as well we were taking a bunch of pictures if you follow me on my instagram you would have seen that i shared some to my story but guys 
This is just so cute. I just need to get like a little photo album to keep all the photos now. But I'm definitely going to be taking this on all holidays and catching some memories. And this will basically be the camera where the pictures never really make it on social media. So if you're having a bad hair day, who cares? This is like a memory making camera. That's kind of like how I'm seeing it anyways. Okay, so next thing I'm going to show you is something that Jack's parents got me. So Jack's parents sent me across some money to buy some clothes because... So you guys know I'm kind of get, becoming clothes obsessed coming into this new year. I may want to focus my Instagram more on fashion items. So with the money that they sent me, I bought, continuing on with Molly May, one of Molly May's new PLT collection coat. It's really hard to show you guys because it's so long. Way. This is the picture of it. So it's like thick leather. It comes with this hood. Um, I downsized one size and it's still quite oversized on me. The reason I did this is I learned this mistake. You may notice if you follow me on Instagram, I posted a picture in this grey jacket, which is listed as super oversized on the PLT website. I ordered it in a size 12. I am a size 12. And guys, it was literally like a humongous on me. So I ended up reordering it in a size 6. So this jacket that I'm wearing is actually a size 6, fun fact. So this jacket wasn't listed as super oversized, it was just listed as oversized, so I downsized to a size 10. It still is quite big, but it is a jacket I would leave open, so I didn't bother sending it back because I definitely think oh, I can get away with it. But when PLT say oversized, they mean oversized. <laughs> but yeah, I'm absolutely obsessed with this jacket. Um, so yeah, thank you so much to Jack's parents for sending me the money to get this. Okay, so I have a few more items to show you guys, which I'm just going to show you which my some of my family members got for me. Um, so thank you in advance to my aunties and my grandma for giving me these. I would just like to say on top of all these presents, I have about a million boxes of chocolates and sweets, but we're not going to go into that. I think what's best, instead of taking this out of the packaging, I'm going to show you the pictures of the clothes that I that I got so first of all I got this brown bikini just needed an extra bikini for my holiday you know you can never have too many holidays you can never have too many bikinis especially when like most of your holidays this year are going to be like beachy type holidays so I got this brown bikini and I also got this bikini wrap which is absolutely gorgeous on um so got them which I thought may or may not pair together I also got this a gorgeous opoly set and guys the material of these clothes, they're like, it's like trackies almost, but it's like smart, you know? I also got a bunch of jewelry and, and guys honestly, just being spoiled as per usual. I am going to wrap this video up now. I will be back with a new YouTube video very soon. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe below. I hope you guys had honestly the most amazing Christmas and New Year. And I'm so, so excited for 2022. And thank you to everyone who's following me on this journey. Let's make this year one to remember and one in my, in my opinion, one to catch up on the past two years, which I feel like has definitely been very slow and parts of it's been wasted. Thanks COVID. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I will catch you in a new video very soon.